Alright, hey, hey, net everybody, this is Pika here, and I'm here to present to you the official playthrough of Pokemon Black, Pokemon Randomized Black, Part 2. Let's get started. Oh yeah, I gotta remember. Is there any way I can delete this save file I have? Because I... Uh, hmm. Maybe this? No! <laughs> okay, that's not gonna work. Yep, time for me to save state. Alright, hopefully the game's running battles should be running smoothly. And yes, I still have Mary. So I, find I also got this XP code, which means now Konoha and Takumi are now level 10. Let's see. Hmm. Here we go. Okay. Oh, that's weird. Oh, okay. ID number... Listen to that. Wait, what the... Can I... Oh, god, that would've been... What the hell am I... Oh my god, that's weird. Oh, Jesus. I can't do this. That's so awesome! I never knew you could do that! <laughs> well, this is gonna be fun. I'm gonna be doing my signature. And please note, I'm not doing this with a, uh... Alright. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, <laughs> shit! Please note that I'm not doing this on a the pencil. There we go. There. <laughs> That's horrible! Alright. Still experiencing slowdown. What the hell is going on here? Alright, so I think this what Okay, I am gonna go into this for Okay, I don't know what it is with this uh <sighs> Let's read what's up on here. Let's see, you can learn the basics of Pokemon at the trainer school. That's it. Striaton City is nestled in the forest and the breeze smells like trees. Wow. What a nice message. Alright, so I think what this is gonna I think what we're gonna do in this up in this episode is that we're just gonna Head into Striaton City, get our little Dream Yard Pokemon. Yes! What is it, Skype? Akari! It's your mom, how are things? Are you and your Pokemon getting along and enjoying your journey so far? I needed to talk to you, so I called, but I'm going to hang up the, the cross transceiver right now, or X transceiver, however people want to interpret it. Oh, hi, Mom. What are you doing here? Akari? I finally caught up with you, and look how far you've come already. Professor Juniper said that you were probably headed for Strides and City by now. I have another present for you. Akari, try these on. Finally, the running shoes! When you're wearing the running shoes, you can go anywhere in a flash. Let me read you the instructions. Hold the B button and run faster than normal. Put on the running shoes and tear around to your heart's content. That's what it says. I bought these a long time ago and stashed them away somewhere. What, were you waiting for me to go on this journey so you can give them to me? <laughs> I found them when I was cleaning up. Guess it's good to clean occasionally. You're a neat freak. Akari, you understand that you're never really alone, right? You're with Pokemon, you have friends, and you're always in my thoughts. That's alright then, enjoy your trip! Wow. Alright, I'm gonna... Now that we finally can run, I'm gonna head back into Accumulatown. 
Oh yeah, someone commented on my voice. Like, apparently the voice acting makes this more unique, and it's like, well, a lot of people voice act in Pokemon games. <laughs> but I think the reason why I decided to do it is because I can actually take the role seriously. Not that I'm saying that not other people take... Just wanted to make the tune more lively. Let me just listen to it. But, um, I'm not saying that other people don't take their voice acting. Like, in Pokemon games, people don't seem to take their voice acting. Ugh, shit, how do I explain this? Basically, um,. What do you have to say? On route too many trainers train their Pokemon having a battle. What do you Yes! Guess what I know? I know Pokemon can remember up to four moves at a time. Hee <laughs> hee. But as it seems that like, you know a lot of people don't take their voice like don't take voice acting seriously in Pokemon. Weak Pokemon, strong Pokemon, cool Pokemon, cute Pokemon, many Pokemon look forward to meeting you. I bought five of them. But it just seems but it's like it's like and if they do and they they do take their voice their voice that those skills seriously, it's like some of them just give people the wrong voices. But but and here's the thing about me want, wanting N to have the best voice. <sighs> okay. Let me give you the benefit of my experience. Blah. Yeah, I know. I can only take up to six. Pokemon do everything in our power. Blah, 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 blah. If you get strong, you can move forward. If you move forward, you'll be stronger. That's a cool thing about journeys. When a hero leads the world, a Pokemon is going to come and help the hero. Everyone in the universe region knows that. Pokemon will be strong if you train them even if they're weak. Now, love is what's important. But yeah, it seems- but it's like with N's character, a lot of people don't seem to give him a lot of respect for his voice. A pokey ball You can't catch Pokemon if you don't have a Pokeball. There are many types of Pokeballs, so use the best one for the job. But it just seems that they, you know, they don't seem to take N's voice seriously. It's like... What do you have to say? Uh, sure. Fire, water, fuck. Water. Yeah! Wait, I get nothing out of that? Fuck you. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Yeah, the Shimachi's still merry. I just did not feel like changing it for this video. Because it's still the same day. And it's like, and it's like, N res but it's like, yeah, N deserves respect, uh, like all the other characters. So it's like, and considering that I kind of understand how he feels towards the end of this game, yeah. Okay. Pollution. All right, I had it. Hopefully the battles aren't going to be slowed down. A Wormadam?! Yep, the battles are still going to be slowed down. God, I hate this. Hmm. 
I'm sorry if I'm speeding through this, but it's like the the battle slowdown is horrible. I don't understand why it's not why it's like this why it's not like this in Platinum. I mean, is it just because the Pokemon Black requires a lot more RAM? Let's just say. I don't want to worm it in. That's why I didn't catch it. Thank you! I was about to lose my mind. Oh my god, yes! Kingja! 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 But I just have a feeling this is gonna be a bitch and a half to catch. Because it's a fully evolved thing. Hmm. But um. <laughs> but still. But still. N deserves just as much as respect as the other characters, and that's why it's like, and considering how much of a fucking girl, fangirl I am of him. <laughs> that's also another thing someone commented on, was that, you know, like, towards the end that, um, that I seem to laugh a lot towards the end. Trust me. That's nothing. Just wait until, you know, just wait until, uh, we get to Nimbasa City and we're on the Ferris wheel together. <laughs> then that'll change real quick. I'm just trying to get this thing down. Really? Oh my god! <clears throat> oh my Jesus Christ. Fuck it. I don't even have enough Pokeballs, do I? No, I've stocked up. Okay, I don't remember that shit at all. Expecting that to be harder to catch! You know what? I'm not even mad. King just data was added. Kingja, the dragon Pokemon. It lives in caves on the seafloor and creates giant whirlpools every time it moves. Five foot of Jesus Christ, that thing's five inches taller than me. That would be scary. What can I call you? Hmm. Kingja. Hmm. I can't seem to think of anything, really. Ah. Oh. You know what? No, that's not it. Here we go. Shinichi. I seem to have a team of just males on here. Oh, thank God! I did not want to sunkern. Oh my god, I'm pressing the fucking... <sighs> Alright, Kinjo, I mean, Shinichi, you're brave-natured. 
which means that ups your attack. Wait, it ups your attack and lowers your speed. Sniper powers up moves to become crit hit. Oh shit, that's nice. I could have caught this ring. Oh my gosh! A Torkoal! I love Torkoal. Just let me out so I can go to the Pokemon Center and heal. But um, yeah. This game runs so much better, like, without- So look, it runs so much better without the, uh, without me recording it, but it's like, I need to record this now that I'm doing an official playthrough of it. But yeah, I like that someone's complimenting my voice acting. It's like- <laughs> Oh my gosh. Thank you. You know, and it's like-, and it's like and it's like everybody voice acts, but again, I'm, I seem to be the only one who gives a sh who seems to actually give a shit about the characters. Like I, I think in the effect, like basically how I do develop voices for some of the cast is like is through their personalities and how they interact with others. Which is why for me with N, it's gonna be difficult because with my desiring for him to get the best voice possible. You have bubble and water gun. Nice move set. Nice. I just want Kendra to get some XP here. I'm crying because you're spraying water on me. But but it's like because like I know of N's personality traits, but how am I gonna convey that into a voice? Which is kind of funny. But it's- but here's something kind of funny. I freaking find out that- that's like, in the English dub of the anime, he's got- <laughs> He does- He should've seen me when I was doing- when, when that was happening. Alright, what stats? Nice. But still, you guys should have seen me when that when I heard his voice. It's like ah, it's so boyishly perfect. <laughs> and then I find that, and then when I go to his own Wikipedia page, or I should I should say his Bulbapedia page, he's got the same voice actor as Izaya from Durarara, which kind of <laughs> like and, I, and it doesn't click in my head until I think about the dozenth time I've seen his page and his Japanese voice actor is Hiroshi Kamiya. And the thing is, I kept passing by, and I'm like, who is that? And then I freaking find out that- And then I find out when Kano's- Con- or Kano- What am I doing? When Kano's voice act- Kano's voice actor- A trainer catches another trainer's eye! This is the start of the Pokemon battle! Kano's voice actor came out, and it's like, it turns out it's not the same person that a lot of people were expecting him to be. And I'm like, who the fuck is Kamiya? I've never heard of him before. So then I look up, because someone, because on another wiki it said that, you know, someone was really good at impersonating the actor, and I'm like, Kamiya, that's the same person who a lot of people were thinking was Kano. So I looked up on there, and I find out he's the voice of Izaya. I'm like, shit, why didn't they pick him? 
Because Kano is so perfect for Isaiah. <laughs> yeah, and that, and that's like... That's like a go on... And that, and then that shit doesn't click with me until after... What? You are too strong! Yeah, I know! Level 10 already! When you Pokemon don't have enough energy to fight, just walk on the road! Pokemon only appear in tall grass! Trainer tips. Po Pokemon that part participate in battle receive experience points. Have a Pokemon battle often and make them stronger and stronger. Did I say stronger and stronger or better or better? You battling me? Yeah, you are battling. So it's kind of surprising to hear it end with an Isaiah voice. Molly. Isn't that a country? Molly? Or a city? Anyway, but it's um... But yeah, I need to get off the topic of N because I'm really not helping myself here. Shinichi is kicking ass! Look at that, man! Even at last, my Pokemon is still cute! No, it's not! It's a Perloin! Besides, Pikachu is best Pokemon. Oh man, this is gonna be so much fun. Oh yeah, considering I technically have two water starters. Cause if you think about it, because my Pokemon- because- because Strikes is- because- I'm probably- I'm gonna be battling against Chili. Because my starter's a Snivy. I already- I'm gonna get another water- AN Excadrill! The fuck is this shit? Nice. Jesus Christ. An Eevee! Okay. Ah! Why is it never like this in my in my platinum training? Like, it's like, after I hit, beat a certain number of Pokemon, the Pokemon never come back. Are you serious? I'm nearly there! But, um, let's see. So basically, I recorded Air Part- my- Part 2 of Air earlier today, which was at 11 wait, 10 something. That shit lasts for an hour and 13 minutes. Now here's the reason why I started getting... Just run. Why I started getting... Lillipop, Lillipop, my Lillipop, go! But the reason why I started getting like... Lillipop! Was because I was trying to get a headache, and it's like this was the longest day ever. All I already knew this was heading into an hour-long session of me recording it. And it's like, and, and it's like as much as I love me size voice, I don't like it when she goes really super loud. You know, and it's like it was gonna take me forever to edit and and upload that because. Good job talking me. Jesus Christ. Your Pokemon uses those kinds of moves? But 
But yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong, I like air. It's just that, you know. THE ONE TIME! NINE TAILS! Shit, there were a lot of good things I could have caught. Don't get me wrong, I love Shinichi, but Jesus Christ. Also, I'm noticing that there's not many females. A potion. Nice. And a Pokeball. Alright, so tomorrow there's not gonna be a, po a Pokemon Black Part 3 because I'm gonna be streaming tomorrow. Akari! Come on, Akari! Oh god, I forgot how to do her voice. Excuse me. Hey, listen, let's have a Pokemon battle! Please, the Pokemon Kai become a little stronger! Ready or not, here I come! Alright, Bianca. Let's see what you have, guys. You have a little pup. My favorite food! <laughs> God, I forgot her voice already. I always seem to forget Bianca's voice because it's like... Because basically it's like... Are you serious? Because it's like, it's high pitch, but it's like... But it's like every time I do a high pitch girl voice, it always ends up being... <laughs> Which is why it's gonna be a pain in my butt when I do freaking all paths of Katama Shoujo. Cause it's like. Okay, this little one is up next! Because, I mean, with Rin it's easy because it's like. Cause it's like, you know, this really isn't helping. You know, with Emmy it's like. It's like, are you ready? Are you ready? Uh oh, am I in trouble? Yeah, you are. But she's name it's gonna be hard because. Lily, it's like, it's like, it's su it's super effective. Like, it's really quiet and simple sounding. Well, with Hanako, it's gonna be like, it's gonna be like, he grew to level twelve. Like, freaking shy as heck. All right. Oh, I couldn't win. Seven hundred bucks. I keep saying bucks when it's pokey. Alright. Woohoo! You are a tough cookie, Akari! I'm gonna work hard so I'm training my Pokemon so we won't lose anymore! Okay, bye bye! Pointless! Pointless! Now we're in Stryton City. Alright, which means I'm gonna be grinding for Monday. Thank god. Basically what I mean by that is that um is that basically since I'm I'm not gonna be uploading any like the only thing I'll be uploading on Sunday is what I have from a sh from the stream tomorrow. If I don't have anything then I'm gonna upload um my stream of ghost trick phantom detective. You multiplied again! Stop multiplying! Alright, um... Are you looking for the gym leader? He's not here! He could be in trainer school! If you want to challenge him, please go find him! The trainer school is not far from this gym! What do you have to say? I too studied at the trainer school when I was a beginner! That was all you had to say? Ugh, god damn it. What's over here? Nothing. And I saw there was a Pokeball. Let me go, let me go, let me go, uh oh.
XP! Completely useless! That must be the trainer school right there. Hello? There's Sharon! What are you doing here, buddy? When a Pokemon is poisoned, its HP decreases while it is battling. Hey, Akari. Have you come looking for the gym leader? Yes. He was, he was here talking about Pokemon types until just a few moments ago. Maybe you walked right past him? By the way, Akari, will you have a battle with me? Why not? I want to test how important items are in battles. No. Really? I wanted I really want to try out my arms, so I'll just wait here until you decide you're ready. It's so hard to do a normal voice for him when I don't know it. Oh my gosh. Uh, yes. Well, let's see how effective my items are. Or maybe I should test how well I can battle without items? Anyway, this is an indoor match, so let's battle without getting too rough. Tepic, really? Level 8. This is gonna be a tough battle. It's just because I'm using cheats. Again, I'm, I'm gonna have to put in my thing that I'm a cheetah. Nah, because... It's important to choose which item your Pokemon holds. Yeah, we know that much. I see! Losing you means I, I still have a lot to learn. Okay. So learning to use items as well is definitely important then. Oh, here, Akari, I'll give you these berries. Oh, and berries! If you give a Pokemon this kind of berry to hold, it will eat, eat it to heal up when its HP goes down in battle. But if you give Pokemon man-made items like potions to hold, they can't use them. Well, good luck then. Bitch. <laughs> that sucked. Oh, there's the gym leader. Yes, yes, I am a gym leader of this town. You are... right, you want to challenge the gym. In that case, what was the first Pokemon you chose? Snivy, I see. It's weak against fire-type Pokemon. I think you need to prepare to face that type. For example, try training your Pokemon in the Dream Yard. Please excuse me now. Yep, and we're going there yet. Never. Uh. Right. We are training here now. Let's train Pokemon together. Hell, oh, but still, with it being Friday, the weekend's coming up again. Yay! Last Airy. Hey, look, the first part of my name. My real name, I mean. Basically, um, all, I also can't wait to see the new Mikako City Actors episode. I just hope to god it will be better than the last one, it was horrible. But still- oh yeah, I think that's another one thing to talk about. People are ripping into that anime right now. Because it's so bad. And it's like, it's not that bad to be honest. Water gun, yes. Get rid of supersonics, I hate that shit. Basically, um, it's like, and it's like, now here's the thing why I don't think Mikako City Actress is horrible. 
again, now basically it's produced by Shaft, and I've never seen any of Shaft's works before. Like, I've never seen them, the Magi Madoka Magica series, nor have I seen the Bake Monogo Monoga Monogatari series. So I don't know what they're like. Two, I've never seen any of the. I have not read the Kage Pro Project, Kage Pro's manga and light novels, so I've never seen those either. So I'm a I'm a I'm a bit of a disadvantage here, cause it's like cause it's like I have two of those factoring against me, and it's like and here's the thing though like people are ripping a new one because it's like because the pacing's wonky the 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 animations the st the studio is using the same animation. Both yes. Get rid of Lear. Great, you have a time as a trainer! <laughs> you know, the, the studio is using the same animation techniques. And that apparently it's just bad in general. It's like, okay, well here's the thing. We're only a quarter of the way through the series. Like... We're just in, right. Tomorrow's gonna be episode five. Episode three was the quarter mark, you know. So, and considering it's only gonna be twelve episodes long, of course the pacing's gonna be fucked up. Of course the pacing's gonna be fucked up. My goal is to outperform gym leaders. Can you win against me? Because it's like they're gonna try to fit everything into twelve episodes. You know, and sometimes, you know, animes have shit beginnings. But it's like, if you're interested in the characters or the story or whatever it is, then stay tuned for it. I mean, hell, it's gotta, I mean... I mean, and someone did point out that basically Kage Pro, it's like, it has a great, like... Like, it has a great beginning and ending, it's just the middle part is hard to figure out. And that's true, though, because it's like, Kage Pro is basically 80% backstory. I mean, god damn it, my ear. Like, like Kage Pro is basically backstory. I mean, let's see. Because it's like, Summertime Record detailed the future. Yeah, Summertime Record detailed the future. Outer Signs also predicted the future. Like, because like, and most of the, like, most of the songs, you know, are just fillers, let's just say. You know, okay, like, like for each of the characters' songs, it's like, I guess Tomei Answer could be considered a prologue, technically. But it's like Shonen Bray details Seto's past. Mikakushi Code, mm. Like, that just details, like. Like, what the fuck Mikakushi Don does, I guess. Oh my gosh. Yobanashi Deceive lets us into the world of Kano. Imagine, Imagination Forest is another thing for me. It's basically a pass for Mary. Kisaragi Attention... Like, details how Momo's troubles as trying to be an idol in disguise. And basically joining Mikakushi Dan. Kagero Days... Just details how Hibia got stuck in the loop. And Hiori. And I know this is spoilers, but if you haven't seen the songs, go! <coughs> Headphone actor we don't know <coughs> anything about! But yeah, Headphone actor we don't know anything about. 
UK yesterday, that just details, um, Takane and Haruka's past. Artificial enemy is just a nice song in general. My Pokemon fought well, didn't they? Your youngster Joey, huh? Hey, hey, you! What was the first Pokemon you received? Snivy, really? Then Pampor could be a big help. Your Snivy does not do well against fire type Pokemon. Say, do you want this Pampor mine? Sure. Okay, here you go. It, it can use water type moves, so that makes it cool against fire types. Yes. Oh my god, another male! Are you serious? There's so many males! <laughs> Shit, alright. <sighs> there we go. Um, sh Lost Time Memory. Well, yeah, Lost Time Memory is a story episode. Let's just. It is a story song. Konoha's State of the World takes place at around the same time as Kagero Days. Children Records considered the opening, so we don't know what's going on there. Ayano's Theory of Happiness details Kido Kano and Seto's past, along, along with herself. Otsukimi recital is basically just telling of he. It's basically the answer song to, to Kagero Days. And I guess kind of like Kisaragi attention? I don't know. Um... Tome answers prologue. Uh, I'm trying to think here. What else? I feel like I'm missing other songs too. I don't think there's much else. But yeah, I mean, notice that there's like a lot of... It's just basically background. You know? Nothing about... To story, and whatever story episodes we do have, it's mostly. It's mostly just Shintaro songs! <laughs> After a battle, to my surprise, my Pokemon evolved and changed its appearance! Some evolve and some don't. Pokemon really are mysterious creatures. You can't go upstairs right now because Fennel said she was testing something she had a scary look on her face. So I can't go up there yet and Juniper said we had to check out someone named Fennel. Oh trainer, do you have enough Pokeballs? Don't be shy, take this with you. A great ball! People are so helpful! You cannot have too many Pokeballs. My advice is that when you use a better Pokeball, it's easier to catch Pokemon. The beginning of my relationship with my wife was our Pokemon battles. I could not defeat her even though I tried many times. Basically the reason why I'm not giving these characters voices is because they're like every other one else. It's only the people that look strange I'm giving voices to. My husband and I are compatible because he cannot beat me in battle. Hi Tavern Trainer! Trainer, Your family must be talking about you right now. I don't know. I want a board to have s a bra to have Pokemon battles. Do you Pokemon have nicknames? When we give a Pokemon a nickname, we grow attached to it. Don't you agree? Yes. There's nothing else I could talk about, so it's like just. What do you have to say? Hey, um, why do you say Pokemon are weak against grass type moves? I know more stuff. Are you the same girl we just met in a Kim Lutel? Lily, I have a favorite model. Her name is Elisa, and her Pokemon are strong, too. Oh, no. You can tell how strong trainers are by the number of gym badges they have. If you're a trainer, you should challenge gym leaders and collect a lot of badges. The GTS links the wall from the second floor to a Pokemon Center. The full name of the GTS is the Global Trade Station. I didn't even start using that until 6th gen. 
trained only fire type Pokemon because they're my favorites, but they have no chance in, ba in the battle against water type Pokemon. Yes, <sighs> maybe I should try to get trained Pokemon of other types. You know, you can't get that. It is quite hard to train six Pokemon at once, so, so I've heard some trainers focus on training three Pokemon at a time. Shit, that's not what I wanted. But yeah, just to quickly cap the uh, Kage Pro thing, it's mostly just backstory, though I, which is making me really curious to see like how the rest of the Makako City actors episodes are gonna be now that you know the beginning is basically established. What am I doing? All right. I need topics to discuss. I just talk, I just seem to ramble on and on about the same damn shit. Oh yeah, we got a Pampor, let's see. Takane. Quirky nature. That doesn't do much to you, to you does it? Yeah, it just doesn't do anything. Your speed though is good, I like it. Your defense is okay. Hmm. All right, so let's take a so let's take a quick look at our team before we go. We have Takane the Pampor, Snivy Konoha the Snivy, Kindra. I mean, <laughs> Kindra, Shinichi the Kindra, and Takami the Lantern. Alright, so that was Pokemon Randomized Black Part 2. Hope you enjoyed it. Katawa Shoujo Part 19 will be up tomorrow. And after that, if you want the link to my live stream, I'll put it in the description today and tomorrow. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys again for, po for Katawa Shoujo Part 19 tomorrow. So, see ya!